Hi Scorpio, welcome to your daily love reading. My name is Pretty, and I'll be doing your love reading today. So before we begin with your love reading Scorpio, please do remember to take what resonates and to leave behind whatever does not. Okay, so let's begin with your love reading Scorpio. at the bottom of the deck we have the lovers and this is gemini energy so this is an energy of an intense strong connection um there is passion and it's mutually felt um there's also this acknowledgement that this connection is significant it's it's special it's there's something about it that you know it's a higher level kind of connection but there is something that needs grounding around the connection and this card can also be that you guys could be at a crossroads um, something about making decisions around the connection and taking into consideration your values and how in alignment you may be in in a practical way so let's see we have the knight of swords air energy the three of cups water energy and we have the lovers gemini energy okay so no, we have the sun, sorry, Leo energy. So this is someone who they do feel like they need to express something to you. Like they have something they want to say. They want to get something off their chest. And it looks like they have good news because we have the three of cups next to the sun. And the sun is a card of expression, you know, and it's a very positive, happy energy. And then with the three of cups, this is celebration, celebrating some sort of good news. So someone could be saying something to you that makes you very happy let's clarify these cards uh scorpio Okay, we have the five of pentacles in the reverse and this is earth energy virgo taurus capricorn energy so a card of confidence a card of coming out of separation or isolation um if there's something this person has been keeping to themselves they're gaining the courage to say to you um there's this desire to be closer so let's see we have the ten of pentacles earth energy the star aquarius energy and the sun again leo energy yeah this person is really they they believe you're the one um, with the star card, there's something unique, again, about you, about the connection they have with you. And they do see it as something that has a lot of potential to lead into the Ten of Pentacles. That's what they want with you. So it does look like they're making you some sort of a solid offer. Um, this is someone who is um, ready to pour all of themselves into this. And they're being very raw with you, very genuine with you. So this person could be pouring their heart out to you. Um, expressing a desire to have a family with you or to have a secure long-term relationship with you okay so i'm going to pull out an oracle card for you scorpio okay we have it's time to release negativity full moon in scorpio so this connection is transforming uh in a positive way let's see Okay, we have honeymoon enjoy the bliss of holiday time together so a very positive happy period is coming for this connection okay we have nobility and self-esteem 
There is nothing noble in being superior to your fellow men. True nobility lies in being superior to your former self. Okay, so I'm going to pull out a card for your advice for you. Okay, so we have surrender to your intuition. Tune into your inner voice. Be aware of any gut feelings, flashes, knowings, or aha moments that come through to guide you. Okay, so that's what I'm seeing for you, Scorpio. I hope you have a really, really good day, Scorpio. Bye, Scorpio.